I decided to do more of your Dead by Daylight challenges. I hate myself. You guys seemed to like the first episode of this and showed some really good support, so I figured I would do it again. So we're back with five more challenges, taking suggestions from my original community post as well as the comments of that latest video. Again, we're looking for challenges that are challenging, but can be done within the realms of a single video, not like go on a hundred game Sadako slugging win streak. What do you think, Antonio? I'd like to continue to do this series, as I actually have quite a lot of fun with it. So, if you have any more challenges that I have not done, make sure to leave them in the comments of this video, and you might get included in the next. And if you enjoy this video, make sure to drop a like and subscribe. Remember, at 75k, we'll be doing every adept challenge in the game. So this first challenge, I don't actually have the real comment of when this was made, because it was on my Twitch channel, and I just forgot to make a screenshot of it. But it was essentially to play a game using only exhaustion perks, but to not get exhausted a single time during the match. There's a lot of different exhaustion perks you could choose from, but the build I opted in for was first Lithe, so we wouldn't be able to vault any windows, Balanced Landing, so we couldn't fall from any high places, Smash Hit, meaning we cannot get a pallet stun on the killer, and then Background Player, meaning we cannot sprint as the killer is picking up one of our teammates. I thought this would be a pretty fun challenge, and I'm curious to see, because we're going to have to play a whole lot differently and a little bit more safe. So hopefully you'll enjoy. All right, we are on the Temple of Purgation. You could obviously do this, like, pretty easily by taking certain exhaustion perks. You know, you could take Head On, Dramaturgy, Dead Hard, things like that. You just don't have to hit the button. Oh my god, it's a Bubba. Uh, ha, ha, ha. Please don't tell me he's on me. Oh my god, he's insane. Come out! Oh my god, I can't stun him. I can't stun him. Pre-drop. That's a pre-drop. I can't vault either. Oh no. This is, uh, you know, the more I look at this, the more I'm like, this is pretty difficult. Pre-drop. <laughs> he's gonna, dude, he's gonna keep chasing me. I gotta leave. I gotta leave. I gotta go. <laughs> oh no. Dude, I was like, you know what, as soon as that happened, I was like, this might be more difficult than I expected. The background player is the real one. We have to make sure that anytime he downs somebody, we are incredibly, we, we don't sprint at all. There's not really any good, like, loops that you could just keep running. Like, give me, like, a, like a, a Borgo long wall or something. I'm also so used to, like, pre, like, getting the stuns on a bubba in pre-dropping just does not seem like the the way to go about it because you like end up losing more distance because he breaks the pallet he's on your ass instantly and not being able to use any exhaustion perks to get away i am now getting more terrified by the moment knowing my ass i'm gonna do the stupidest thing and hit like this little tiny ass crack and then i'm not gonna be able to i'm gonna hit like balance landing because of it i'm gonna drop like two centimeters all right that's another gen done Oh, so we're slugging. All right, we have to wait for background player to subside. He picked up again. Does it go on cooldown for a bit? I'm not too sure. All right, I just want to make sure. I mean, I think we're good. Okay, we're not exhausted. Everything's fine. Like me in particular, running down like these stairs, I'm going to fall off the side and get balanced. Be very careful. All right. Surprising we're getting a lot of gens done. Victoria, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> Dude, he'd be looking like a Castlevania character, for real, for real. Fucking Lord Belmont. You must be the Belmont. All you gotta do is hit a little... Oh, he's down here. The gamer is down here. I ain't about that life. You don't think he runs this way, right? I like you. Oh, I brother. You. This guy stinks. I think I got it. Oh my god, I think I got it. Oh. And then we drop. And then we drop. Okay, okay. Ooh, ooh, buy ourselves a little more time. We're pre-dropping everything. Oh, he went back down. Oh, he's in the hole. <laughs> we only have one gen left. Hold up. Okay, there's a hill here. And hills do scare me. Because if he comes through here, we have to run straight down. That is not the ideal situation. Oh, that is also not the ideal situation. Is basement there, though, is the question. Okay, we have finished. We have finished. See, that scared me. I don't know if he's gonna pick up this gamer. Okay, she said go get the door. Okay. She pointed at me, told me to get the door. I'm following instructions. I'm doing my part. 
we're really about to escape. I mean, to be fair, we kind of gen rushed the absolute living hell out of this person. Oh no, Vittorio! Is is Nia gonna be able to? Nope, Nia didn't get didn't get them. This is tragic. Oh, he is he is coming here. I I'm gonna I'm gonna let him down me, and we escape. Look at that. We didn't even use an exhaustion perk. I mean. Honestly, not as stressful as it could have been, but I'm gonna take it. Now, let's see if the rest of the team gets out. Yeah, I was about to say he was right there. Yeah, she is uh, most certainly cooked. Vittorio, you gotta leave. Oh, he's got a beamer. Dang, he came back at the absolute worst time. Okay, no, that was good. That was good. Never mind, Vittorio is a god. Vittorio is no longer a god. Just a little update for our boy Vittorio. <laughs> it's not looking too good. Listen, I was only following instructions from my teammate. This next challenge is called Entity Dependency. It's going to be where we only use perks that have an entity interaction. If you actually go into your loadout right here, you can type in Entity, and you can see the perks that have Entity just somewhere in the description about it. But I wanted ones where the entity actually did something, not where like pop, where it just makes you stronger and you're able to kick a gen. I wanted the entity to actually do the work. So I decided to go with a build of Bamboozle for the window to get blocked when we vault it. Then we have Blood Favor. When we hit somebody, it will block pallets in a 32 meter range. Then we have Dissolution. After injuring someone by any means, it activates for 20 seconds. And then if someone vaults a pallet during that time uh, in a fast vault, it will break automatically. And then we have Grim Embrace for a little bit of gen blocking. Decided to go with this on the Doctor because it felt like these perks would work pretty well on him, especially Dissolution. Alright, we got the Disturbed Ward, Crotus Pren. I thought it would be fun to take maybe not, I mean, they're not uncommon, but less common perks that uh, call upon the Entity. Obviously, we have a couple that are like pretty common, like Bamboozle and Grim. But Dissolution and Blood Favor, you know? Ah, so we got a Gamer. Is this Gamer in here? Where'd they run? Where'd they run to? Did I, did I just give away my cards too early? But we have Discipline, which is going to be really good. Oh, fuck. Oh, and that's blocked, ma'am. That's blocked, ma'am. Ooh, you have been struck. You have been struck by Herman Carter. PhD. Then we hit one of those. Boom. She goes down. Obviously, the dissolution is more to maybe pressure after Blood Favor gets inevitably cleansed, you know? Hello, ma'am. Okay, she... Where did she run? Did she run back over here? Ah, yes, see. Get back here. Get back here, gamer. Ooh, that's big. Don't even go for it. Do not even dare. I can't let you get close. Yep, told you. Knew it was going to get cleansed. So we'll go at. Oh my god, she's crawling like a little freaking slug or a snail. It's like she starred in that movie Turbo. Nice. Smart play. To not fully commit to the unhook. That would have at least gotten somebody, like, hit with the... I would have at least hit one of them. Yeah, I figured that one was gonna happen, unfortunately, though. Say goodbye to... To the good old... Blood favor. It got a little value, to be fair. Shake, take a look in here. And we'll kick this one, too. And then maybe once we move towards the middle of the map... Lord Herman will be able to suss out some gamers. Need the reflex check. <laughs> reflex? Reflexes check. Yeah, you ain't, you ain't getting nothing here, butter. Whip. He ain't gonna know. What you gonna do? He's got nothing. Oh, uh, thanks, Entity. I appreciate that. Uh, you think the Entity's just, like, watching on some CCTV cameras or something? Just lurking? The monkey's the eye in the sky. He sees everything. Like, oh, oh they're like eating a bat or eating some nachos or something. And then they're like, oh shit, shit, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta intervene. Let's go back over here. This is gonna be blocked again from Grim. And then realistically, we need to find the Kate. Okay, so they healed up over here, meaning that we can probably static blast right around here. Yep. Figure that was gonna happen. Oh, really? She's that, she, she like that, huh? Hello. I think this is the person we have not hooked, though. This is the, yeah, the chick with the flashlight. Mmm, actually. Yep! Entity! <laughs> Getting that dissolution! Oh, let's go. That's, I honestly did not expect that to work, but it is a pretty solid one on Doctor, because you kind of force them. It's either you shock, and they don't vault and you hit them, or they vault, and you still hit them. 
Unfortunately, though, that was our obsession. Realistically, I think we just kind of sit nearby. I mean, this was the gen that had the most progress before. Wait for our static blast to come off cooldown and then just use it like right here. And if not, we know they're on, they're on the other side of the map. Okay, or they have Calm Spirit or I just was not in range there. Okay. He does not have Calm Spirit, but we should be able to hit him here. This should be a free hit. Free little M. That's such a good R Renato outfit. Let me let me be real. The little dinosaur. Wait, that's not even Renato. That's that's Dwight. Bro, don't talk to me. I ain't I ain't had any caffeine today. Nice. We stunned him there. He can't even use that. He's not gonna be able to use that either. Oh, he's gonna get that though, huh? No, he didn't. I'm looking for a Danny. Nope, no dead hard. So, the gen that they finished was the one that they had originally pressured. Hello. What the? Hello, gamer. This is a free M1. We are balanced. That's definitely balanced. Okay. Now we can relax. We can start the relax. <laughs> so, we're doing three? So we're doing three gens? That ain't that ain't right. Okay, no, this person's injured. Follow the blood trails to the stinky, stinky gamer. You think you are very fast, but you are not. Dropping in. Didn't work. Did not work. Okay, well, you made a mistake there, ma'am. Because we have discipline. Nice. That is terrifying, though, that they did those gens that quickly. I'm frankly not a fan. Neither is the game, I guess. All right. This next challenge should be fun. It is called Neck Problems. We're going to play a game as Survivor, but without being able to turn our camera around at all. As you know, that's pretty important when trying to loop as a Survivor and just trying to figure out where you are in relative location to the killer. So just holding W and trying to go forward might be a bit of a challenge for me. All right, we are on the... Are you choking? Are you choking? Pit, and this is going to be a difficult one. Because one of the main things... What the hell? Did someone... What did, what did I get the alert notification from? It's an undetectable killer, meaning this is probably Wraith. Certainly. Nope, it's Mookle Myers. Not being able to look behind you as Mookle Myers does not sound like a fun time. Because you'll never know where he's going to be lurking. Stalking from, even. And that's one of the things that you, like learn just in general from you know playing dbd like one of the first survival rules in the movement realm is to always check behind you so you don't like end up pre-dropping pallets too early or just making a fool of yourself i don't like this so i have to turn we need to position ourselves in a good way now i know the challenge says without ever turning your camera oh god without turning your camera around so we have to keep facing forward but it doesn't say anything about left or right I don't know. I'm going to sprint first to the other side of the map. I don't care. I'm not letting him find me. This is mostly a thing that's like used for chase, I would say. He might be actually trying to stalk off of me right now, but I won't let him. I've got too much speed. I'll get you, bitch. I am running. I am running. I am running. He's going to keep stalking me. Oh, no. I've surely messed up. So we're definitely... Oh my god, he's so fast. Oh no, ain't no way. Ain't no way. Oh no. I need to hit the window. I need to hit the window. Hit the window. Hit the window, get in the locker. Get in, no! Oh my god! He tried to get me! Oh no! I think I might have accidentally looked behind me as well. It's a force of habit. Oh, I guess this is my camera being turned around. I guess this is turning. I'm facing myself. Well, goodbye, tap. Goodbye, tap. I'm sorry if I fuck it up. I failed the challenge, I guess. I'm just trying to get out of here alive. It's much more threatening going up against a tombstone Myers. If I said it once, I'll say it again. It probably needs to get removed from the game, the Evil Incarnate achievement, just because it it, it doesn't really help Meyer's fun gameplay experience. And he's just gonna, he's gonna slug. Do we have any gens left on the side? I don't think we do. That is simply unfortunate. 
We've been trying to contact you. Oh, this guy's cooked. Party. He's coming after me, huh? Holy fuck. Get in. Oh. Oh, I mean, that was kind I was kind of looking behind me. You know, I definitely failed this challenge. 1,000%. I'm staying in here. You kick that gen as much as you want. I ain't leaving. I ain't fucking leaving. I'm gonna keep doing this gen anytime I hear that terror radius. I am just instantly going into a locker. Instantly in a locker. <laughs> you keep kicking it, dude. You can only kick it so many times. <laughs> this is so fucking cursed. Hello, Ed boys. Hey, take me, man. Take me. <laughs> I've definitely failed this challenge already. I mean... It's so instinctive, man, and I'm scared. Imagine I had adrenaline right now. That would be a shame. I get that he wants the achievement, and trust me, I have struggled through it as well. But, you know, <laughs> listen, if I wasn't able to get it in, like, 40 matches, neither would you. Thanks, sir. Back on over to this generator. In locker we go. <laughs> Guys, come on, you can get it now. It's all right, I'm near a locker, at least. That's at least good. Oh, wait, low key? This Fang could get me. Oh, oh, Fang, come get me. Fang, come get me. Fang, come get me. Thank you. Thank you. I failed the shit out of this challenge. Hey! Hey! No! Hey, no! I'm on your team! Does anybody else see this shit? <laughs> How do you feel? How do you feel about that, lady? Get away from me. That's toxic, man. I definitely failed that one. This one, uh, this one might be a little bit difficult. We're doing an only scoped death slinger. So when I say this is that we have to be aiming down the sights at all times on the character and we can only hit people that we have speared after shooting them. So I wanted to do a little bit of tear radius with this as well as a couple of add-ons. First off, we will need the wanted poster to increase our move speed by 3% while aiming and then the jaw smasher to increase it by 1.5% while aiming. Still not very fast. Then we'll be using Monitor and Abuse to sneak up on people a little bit to get some shots in. We have Gearhead to get some aura reading after we've injured some people so we can approach some gens. We also have Jolt just to get some gen regression. And then Plaything. Monitor and Plaything are just going to be kind of working hand in hand together right here to be a little bit more stealthy. I'm not looking very forward to this. I, I don't think we'll be able to get two kills on this. Uh, two hooks might even be impressive. All right, this is going to be the difficult challenge for sure. Only aiming in, just in general. Oh no. You do not move as fast as I thought you did. We are cooked. We are cooked indeed. Ooh, okay. All right, we obviously can reload to not be aimed in. Now, where's this gamer at? Ooh, that's a good Hi, shot. Welcome to Chili's. And we can only hit survivors that we've speared. So now we got to reload again. And then we aim down sights. Oh, no, we ain't catching up to her. We are not catching. Dude, if they hold W, we're cooked. What do we do? Don't worry, I cut her off. No, we got to run up. We got to run up top now. This is all we can do. Nice. That's huge. Let's go. We got two injures. This is insane. All right. Oh, that's gearhead value. Let's go. The shots are on at least. This motherfucker don't miss. We're keeping everyone injured. Oh, man. That's all I needed, though. I needed good shots. Oh, do we have someone over here as well? Okay, so we know Ace is around here somewhere. Oh, I thought I had it. Reload. Reload. Oh, no, no, no. We need to get around the corner. No, we got this for sure. We got this for sure. Oh, he dropped it. But I think we get him. Yes, we get him. We get him. Let's go. That's a down, baby. Oh, these gens are cooked. All right. We can pick him up, obviously. Like, you can't aim down sights while picking someone up. Oh, this is kind of fun, though. It's definitely hard. I don't know if we're going to get the 2K like the challenge suggested, but we'll do our best. Hopefully, if we can get some more downs, play thing can come in. Uh, we can, I'm going to say we can also kick gens because you can't aim down sights while doing that. Oh, oh, that's a heal. That's a heal. They're healing. They're healing. They're healing. Ain't no way. Bro, the shots are on. The shots are on. Wait, that was insane. All right, pick up. Let's go. I I normally go for like kind of the quick scope kind of route, 
when playing Slinger. So this is just, this is just a weird feeling. I basically never use these add-ons. It'd also be nice if someone could tell me what the actual speed you move at while aim down sights is. Because it's not fast. Oh, bro did not know because he's got plaything right there. Do we, do we try to tunnel a little bit? Damn. Unfortunate. Aimed back in. Let's see. Oh, he's insane. Wait, he's so good. He's so good. Dude. I can get him. I can get him. No. No, I got him. I got him. Trust. I got him. Trust. All right. Huge. Big down. Let's go. <laughs> This is so stupid. I'm sorry for going after you, sir, but I found you and I had to I had to make you mine. I see someone with gearhead over there. We heard Nancy originally. Okay, so we know that they're on this gen right here based off of gearhead. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Can't make it. Can't make it. The shit's stuck. Uh-oh. I thought that might have hit. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, where is this person at? They kept running? Did they keep running? They did keep running. You motherfucker. Yeah, that's too far. I don't think that hits. We have to be really, really, really careful about this. If you weren't so slow, I honestly think this is pretty possible. Are they healing under the hook over here? Ooh, looks like someone's going towards this plaything totem. No. They healed up in a corner somewhere. I lost all of my progress. That's so unfortunate. Get back here. Don't vault it. She vaulted it. Don't vault it. Got her. Huge blaze. My shot's actually not bad right now. No! Honestly, maybe just shooting is the play to go because we get more value because we can move a little bit faster while reloading. Nice, that's a down. Okay, well, I think it's just the sheer speed at which we move that's really the hindrance. We're hitting some decent shots, however. Who knows, endgame could come in. We saw that they were on main. I'm gonna fan you. Yeah, if it didn't take 13 years in order for me to get to this, like area up here we would be a-okay okay she runs down is she gonna take a route to the left she did oh no that's a shot that's a good shot now i just don't need you to vault that where are we running where are we running oh my god the serpentining nice wait for it that's good patience and that did not hit any of the gens with Surge, that's a oh, wait. I guess I wasn't aiming. My bad. That listen, minor, minor lapse, minor lapse. We gotta aim back and get open. No, you'll never catch me alive. You're not getting her. I'm getting my one kill. You'll never get her. She is mine. You need to relax. I saw someone running over there to the right. They might try to go from here. The bad thing though is, too, is we cannot really do hook trades because we have to reload every single time. Realistically, I see us getting nothing here. Oh, she's dead. Oh, she's insane. My shot's actually not bad right now. That's a... That, dude, it's so much harder to do that while aiming. Oh, I thought we had it. No, she opened it. I'm not going to be able to catch up to her. Come on, you motherfucker. Get back here. Get back here. Get back here. Where's... Ne dude, okay. You can't... You, you're, you can't be serious right now, Ace. You could not be serious. That's fine. <laughs> we got a kill. The fact that I even got six hook states, I think, is pretty successful. And finally, we are doing another killer challenge where we cannot break a single pallet on the map unless it's a god pallet and there is no way around it. Must get a 3k. It's going to be a little difficult as I wanted to make this hard. Instead of using a character that can kind of avoid pallets like a Huntress or a Trickster, we're going to be using a basic ass M1 killer like Mr. Philip over here. I have decided to go with the build of Double Swift Hunt so we can uncloak quickly to get to those pallets. Then we have Coup de Grasse to extend our range because we're definitely going to need that. Then we'll just be using Blood Favor to block those pallets at the start as well because, you know, don't have to break them if they can't drop them. And then just pop goes the weasel for a little bit of gen regression. This one... I might be getting it over my head. All right, so we're on the Toba landing. Definitely some areas where you can get screwed over by some pallets. I would like to try to not break any, just in general, but the one god pallet I think would be like Shaq, actually. Oh, this guy doesn't vault this. Never mind, he does vault it. 
but having blood favor makes it so they can't drop anything in the first place. We hit this, he's gonna hit this vault. Yep. No way, no, this Leon's good at the game. He's very good at the game. I don't like this. Oh my god, you have to go so far around this. I'm gonna lose based off of this Leon. Uh, I think I hit this. Oh, barely, because I had freaking bloodlust. I almost was like, maybe rapid brutality, and I was like, nah, dude, we're gonna have to use bloodlust. I'm, I'm, I'm sniffing the survivors, dude. Ooh, I ain't, I ain't trying to get any splinters, all right? No wood for me. Let's listen to these gens. Hello, we'll kick this. And then now we're gonna run up here. She's gonna run, drop down, please don't have balanced landing, otherwise I cry, she does not. That is a blood favor, favoring my blood. Uh, I don't know if this is blocked. Nice! I will take that down. Well, I almost went and broke the ballot instinctively. I was like, oh nice, got the down, let's get rid of some of the resources. Cannot do that. We'll probably go pop the gen up top. That's what at least what I'm gonna try to do. Yeah, she went ahead and did that. See, that's one gone. See, once this uh, these perks are gone, it's going to be infinitely more difficult. So we're going to kick that gen with pop, and we're going to kick this gen normally, and that gen was still finished. All right. I give up. That's it. I'm committing treason. It's a good vault right there, but we should be able to get her. I don't know. I don't know if I've ever seen this Jane outfit. She only has one vault left. Nice. Oh! That was really good. That was a really good play. This is actually a god palette, though. Oh, that's so close. It was barely two. We needed that, and they can't stun us. Oh, that was so nice. Okay, that's still regressing. Let's pretend to do that. What? What are you doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Kick that. We are dropping in. Ooh, this is good. She's going to vault in. She didn't. Wow, she's insane. It was a good play. I definitely have... Fake it? Nice. I have, I would say, probably the highest... Ugh. It's close between Wraith and Blight, my highest, like, MMR killers. So, you know, most of the time I don't go up against people who are not great. But we did lose our blood favor. Okay, where are we going here? Oh, we're just gonna keep going this way, huh? They're gonna get that gen done up top. Oh, no way. Fine by me. We're going up top, actually. God damn it. I knew that was going to happen. Oh, not the freaking... Oh, my goodness. The coup de grace. It was so close. Yet so far. Yeah, she's just going to drop it. Fuck it. Oh, my God. He on X Games mode. She was not expecting that. I moved so fast. I was moving so fast there. Oh, that's a, that's a shame. It really is. But I'm okay with it. I am okay with that. Let's kick this real quick. And now we're going to go after probably Sable. Or this chick. Does she vault back in? Yep. Yeah, I see these gamers. They know what they're doing. Nice. Good play. She probably runs to this. Do I hit that? Mm, nice. Yeah, they're good. I definitely see some prowess here. I'm going to leave her for a second. And we're going to go back to this gen. What way do we go around this? We have to just keep going. We have to, we have to bloodlust it. How am I not in chase with her? Oh, she's cheating? Never mind, she's not cheating. Dead hard? Nope, no dead hard. Okay, let's go. <laughs> this is... <laughs> Listen, we're doing decent, but I'm still starting to stress out a little bit. I'm still starting to stress, yep. They finished that gen. God damn it. Let's listen to this. Mm, not a ton of progress. Let's go ahead and swing here. Nice, that's a big hit. She definitely knows I have coup. Okay. Oh, she ran into a locker. Please don't have dead heart. I'm looking, I'm looking. Nice. I had to waste that coup de gras stack. It, it could have been a real, real bad time. Let's go back over here, see if we have a gen with maybe some more work on it. Well, I think we did. I'm going to go after Sable. Yep. We're going to take that. Oh, she's running down. Oh, dude, we have to use the freaking... Oh, now, now we're cooked if she just plays around this. She's not actually not even looking behind her. Bastard, you've done it again. That's wild. Okay. Please don't be here. This is a kill, though. Oh, no. You motherfucker. That stun was so long, too. But nice. We, we got her here. We should get her, at least. What? 
I'm gonna be honest, that was a complete and utter fail by me. Someone play fucking Despacito Burrito. And she took the hit. Oh my god, I'm killing my <laughs> I mean, what? Well, I'll take that, I guess. This is- there's gonna be someone else here. I guarantee it. Pretend to go this way, we're gonna go this way instead. Looks like we might only get one kill, gamers. Bro, did they already open? they already opened that door? Ain't no way. That's insane. I mean, I'll take the hits. I don't think we did terrible, all things considered. I disagree. I disagree, Gary. I mean, hi, Leon. I see you around the corner here. What, are you gonna take me on a little trip? <laughs> you got me. Dang, it was close. We probably could have gotten two if the... I mean, the Jane made a good play. We had some pretty good plays in there, though, to be fair. Definitely got... Eh, probably not as bad. There's a lot of safe pallets on there, but I wouldn't call them god pallets, so... they sh Some of them should be, but I, I didn't want to really break any. So, I mean... Eh, it is what it is.